Welcome to quantitative reasoning solution section and we have quantitative reasoning from Lantern Step Book 6, page 16, exercise example B. Thank you for joining in today and to our new viewers, please do well to subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and mathematics problems. And to our subscribers, thank you for staying with us. Okay, so we have this problem before us. We have 12, 9, 4. In here, we have 30, 36, 5. And this last example, we have 16, 64, and 2. So don't forget to like, subscribe to this channel, share with other friends and teachers. Okay, so let's solve. We're going to be working on this. So let's try to find 12. So to find 12, we're going to be having square root of 9 times 4. And square root of 9 is 3 times 4. That gives us 12. And to find 9, we have 12 divided by 4, which is 3 and 3 squared, that's 3 times 3, that gives us 9. And to find 4, we have square root of 9, which gives us 3. And 12 here, divided by 3, we have 4. Okay, so don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Okay, so let's look at this example. Let's find to find 16. We have square root of 64 times 2. This 2 here. So square root of 64 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. And to find 64, we have 16 divided by 2 is 8 and 8 squared, which is 8 times 8, is 64. And to find 2, we're going to have to find 2. To find 2, we're going to have square root of 64, which gives us 8. And 16 divided by 8, 16 divided by 8, we have our 2. All right, so don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and mathematics problems. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and mathematics problems. Bye.